Battle Through the Heavens Chapter 175, Arrival Chapter 175, Arrival Hearing the old voice sounding from within the room, Xiao Yan let out a sigh of relief. The old man who had just rushed into the room slowly retreated out. At the moment, one could see a somewhat old-looking palm on his neck. Like an eagle claw, it was tightly locked onto his throat. Halonga Hiro trademark's expression was somewhat aghast as he stared at the indifferent old man in front of him. Part of the reason for him being caught was because he was unprepared. However, when the palm of the man locked onto his throat, Halang came to a terrifying realization that the originally quick-flowing dochi in his body appeared to have been bound and had changed to a flow with a tortoise-like speed. Regardless of how much effort he put in order to hasten it, the dochi remained mild without any strength. At this point in time, regardless of how stupid H.A. Lang was, he was also able to understand that the old man in front of him was not someone who was only slightly stronger than him as he had thought a euro. From the terrifying hand of the other party, this strength at the very least exceed Ha Lang by over two classes. A euro -e god, this old mana euro trademark's strength has obviously reached the stage where his do chi can transform into wings. Why did he still take this kind of flying beast whose speed was much slower, a Euro Halang sadly wailed in his heart. With great difficulty, he tried to move his throat and said with a hoarse voice a Euro easier a Euro we did not mean to offend you. It is just that we wish to ensure our safe tie a Euro a Euro. Yao Lao glanced at him indifferently. His right hand waved and a rouge jade bottle appeared in his hand. From within that translucent bottle, one could see a blood-red medicinal pill the size of a dragon eye rolling around. A Euro I you want it, right, a Euro waving the jade bottle in his hand, Yao Lao smiled and said blandly. Looking at H.A. Lang who was easily subdued by Yao Lao without any ability to retaliate, the other three middle-aged Mina Euro trademark's expressions were filled with fear. They took a few terrified steps back and their hearts began to feel uneasy. After greed had slowly retreated from their minds, they finally realized just how foolish their actions were. A Euro Iki A Euro KK, sir, you must be joking. We would not dare take things from you. Had we not been afraid that the energy ripple from before would impede our flight, we would definitely not bother you. A Euro Halang laughed dryly as his eyes rotated and he swallowed his saliva. A Euro Arethes was not what you said just now A Euro A Euro Xiao Yan came to the side of the room A Euro trademark S door and leaned against the wooden wall. He thickly glanced at He Lang as he mocked. A Euro E Ki A Euro before, before I was just joking A Euro He Lang laughed dryly. He lowered his head slightly and a pernicious glint flashed in his eyes. He lowered his sleeves a little and a small bag of black colored powder rolled from his sleeves into his palm. A Euro -e originally, I did not wish to kill. But since you seek death, then I A Euro trademark LL forget about eat A Euro A Euro just as the powder in He Longa Euro trademark's hand was about to be scattered, Yao Lao sighed and shook his head. The corner of his mouth curled up in a cold smile. A thick white flame suddenly appeared on the palm that was grabbing He Longa Euro trademark's neck. A Euro A, A Euro. Just as the dense white flame touched He Longa Euro trademark's skin, a terrible pain caused him to suddenly widen his eyes. His body tightened like it was a spring. Following a blood curling shrill, his entire body was completely swallowed up by the thick white flame in a matter of seconds. A Euro a hiss a Euro a Euro. Seeing that He Lang was turned into a pile of black ashes in the blink of an eye, everyone present, including Xiao Yan could not help but inhale a breath of cold air. A Euro ace this the strength of a A Euro heavenly flamey A Euro trademark, A Euro. Feeling a little shock as he watched the scene, Xiao Yan A Euro trademark's heart was in a terrible turmoil. Yao Lao had used the A Euro heavenly flamey A Euro trademark to kill a person back in Wutan CIT, but the strength of Lu Xi at that time was only that of a dojet. Thus, Xiao Yan could not feel its extreme profoundness. However, the one in front of him who had withstood the A Euro Heavenly Flame A Euro trademark for a few seconds was a true Dadoshi. A Euro -e A Euro Heavenly Flame A Euro trademark A Euro No wonder so many people were willing to risk their lives to obtain it. 
This kind of strength the Euro tasked Tisk, it is indeed attractive a Euro Xiaoyan sighed and shook his head. He had to admit that after experiencing the strength of a a Euro heavenly flame a Euro trademark, his hope to obtain it grew far denser. After glancing at the ashes on the ground, Yao Lao waved his sleeve. A gentle wind blew past and scraped the floor clean. He threw the jade bottle to Xiao Yan before gently patting his hands. Xiao Yan carefully received that jade bottle which contained the A Euro Blood Lotus Pill A Euro trademark and stored it into his storage ring. He sighed in relief and lifted his head. Glancing at the three pale-faced middle-aged men with ill intentions, he smiled and asked, A Euro Editor, how do we deal with them, A Euro? A Euro Izanki they have the determination to rob medicine and kill people, it is only natural that they know what kind of price they have to pay should they fail a Euro Yao Lao blandly said. He lifted his eyes and glanced at the three of them. Flipping his hand, a thick white flame once again rose. A Euro Ido you want to jump down yourself, a Euro. Hearing Yao Lo a Euro trademark s in different words, the three men stilled their bodies. Their faces were filled with fear as they lowered their hands and glanced at the ground which was over a thousand meters away. Their heels did not stop shivering. Xiao Yan folded his arms and coldly watched the three men who had descended into terror and hopelessness. His heart did not hold any pity. He knew that if their roles were reversed, these people would definitely not show any mercy and kill the both of them. Since the other side did not intend to show any mercy, Xiao Yan could also temporarily silence these feelings of his and face them. Without raising his head to see the fearful expressions of the three of them, Yao Lo a Euro trademark s finger slowly flicked. Numerous threads of pale white flame continued to rise from his palm and scatter at a Euro. The depressing atmosphere continued for a moment. That middle-aged man who was only a tier one alchemist finally could not withstand the pressure of this atmosphere. Following an oppressive roar, his Dou Qi covered his body. Then he revealed his fierceness as he charged at Xiao Yan, intending to kill. It appeared that he had not completely lost his reasoning as he still knew how to choose the softer target to strike. After this middle-aged man retaliated by attacking, one of the other tier 2 alchemists also suddenly took out a long sword from his storage ring. After which, he let out a cry that was filled with strength as he too charged at Xiao Yan ferociously. In his heart he knew that as long as he could catch Xiao Yan alive and take him as a hostage, he would be able to keep his life today. Ignoring the two men who were pouncing forth, Yao Lao was momentarily quiet before he flicked his finger. A thread of white-colored flame shot from his palm and like an arrow, shot through that tier one alchemist body in a lightning-like manner. Instantly, it incinerated the latter into ashes. After killing a tier one alchemist like killing a chicken, Yao Lo a Euro trademark s finger once again flicked at that tier 2 alchemist who was pouncing forward. However, a soft muffled sound caused his finger to suddenly pause. His old eyebrow twitched as he raised his head with interest. A Euro a puff a Euro a Euro. At the moment, the body of the tier 2 alchemist who was rushing towards Xiao Yan suddenly froze on the spot. He violently vomited a mouthful of bright red fresh blood. Slowly lowering his head, he saw a cold blade that was contaminated by the glaring fresh blood had penetrated his chest. A Euro I U A Euro A Euro turning around with difficulty, that tier 2 alchemist stared intently at his companion who had suddenly attacked him. He cursed in a hoarse voice, A Euro I U A Euro will also die here. Definitely A Euro cannot escape. He will not let you off A Euro. Hearing this, that tier 2 alchemist whose expression was a little mad, once again thrust the long sword in his hand deeper. After which, he suddenly pulled it out. Fresh blood spluttered out and covered his entire body. Seeing his companion whose body was gradually falling, the tier 2 alchemist fiercely took in a deep breath. He suddenly turned around and shouted to Yao Lao, A Euro Ezir, I am willing to follow you. All I ask is for you to let me live. A Euro. Xiao Yan quietly watched the somewhat brutal scene of killing of Oni Euro trademark s companion that occurred in front of him. A long while later, he let out a gentle breath. A Euro or is the extremity of human personality. 
Should you face a hopeless situation in the future, don't a Euro trademark T show your back to those that you cannot trust. Because you never know if a sword that you did not expect would stab into your chest a Euro a Euro ignoring that fawning face of the tier 2 alchemist who was trying to get into his good books, Yao Lao tilted his head, stared at Xiao Yan and said blandly. Tightening his fist, Xiao Yan nodded his head. The scene that had played live in front of him had caused him to be a lot more cautious. A Euro or Ethi's person, you can do what you want. I don't a Euro trademark T need this kind of follower a Euro slowly turning around, Yao Lao walked into the room. All that he left Xiao Yan were vague words. Nodding his head, Xiao Yan inhaled a breath. A somewhat icy smile surfaced on his face. A short while after entering the room, Yao Lao heard a deep muffled sound from outside. He nodded his head and flicked his finger. The rising pale white flame on the tip of his finger gradually disappeared. A euro or creep. A euro. Xiao Yan pushed open the door and entered. At that moment, his body had a little scent of blood. Seeing Yao Lao looking over, Xiao Yan shrugged his shoulders and smiled. A euro or if I left that kind of person by my side, it would be difficult to say when he would change colors. So, I kicked him down a euro. A euro or a dot a euro randomly nodding his head, Yao Lo a euro trademark s sight passed through the window and observed the distant land where it was covered with a gold yellow color. He smiled and said, A euro we are reaching the Tager Desert. Lead a euro trademark s go a euro we will fly ourselves for the remaining distance. Otherwise, there might be some unnecessary disturbance due to the four missing alchemists when this flying bird descends, delaying our arrival a euro. After saying those words, Yao Lo a Euro trademark s body swayed, transforming into a cluster of light and poured into the ring on Xiao Yan a Euro trademark s finger. At the same time, the purple cloud wings that were tightly stuck to Xiao Yan a Euro trademark s back also extended out with a a Euro swish a Euro trademark sound. Slightly flapping the purple cloud wings on his back, Xiao Yan opened the window and leapt down. An intense sound of wind swept past his ears as Xiao Yan a Euro trademark s pair of wings flapped and a purple colored Dou Qi gradually covered his body. Lifting his head, he watched the flying bird magic beast that was flapping its huge feathered wings a short distance away. He smiled faintly. After being stationary for a moment, his flying speed suddenly increased as he transformed into a purple colored light and speedily overtook that flying bird magic beast a Euro. In the distant sky, a purple-colored stream of light instantly slid across the horizon as though it was chasing the stars and the moon. He faced the yellow-soiled city that stood in the golden yellow desert and flew quickly towards it. The rigid city grew increasingly near. Numerous whiffs of heat waves came toward him. He narrowed his eyes and stared at the golden yellow region where the borders could not be seen. Xiao Yan let out a gentle sigh, a Euro or a final training place, Tager Desert. I a Euro trademark VE finally arrived, a Euro.